So now I'm going to explain how to implement this uh, HP bar, health bar to this your current game. And uh, to implement a health bar to this game, so first, so we're going to change only this part. And uh, we're going to make a health bar panel, another pa J panel. So health bar panel. And uh, inside of this create game screen method. So around here, I think. Uh, we're going to initialize uh, health bar panel. New J panel. Bounds. And this time, so we want to place this panel around here. So I'm going to type 100 and uh, 15, 200, and 30. Uh, set background. Okay, so let's uh, use blue again and add add this to container. Hmm. Okay, but if you run this program, then uh, yeah, it's like this. This HP 15, it's still displayed. So we have to change this player panel a little bit. So basically, we don't use this HP 15 anymore. So I'm going to change this bounds for this player panel. And right now, it started from X100, but I'm going to change this to 400. And also, the width of this panel I change this from 600 to uh, 300 and uh, also I'm going to change this height to 30 because I set the height of this health bar panel at 30 it would look better if you use the same number and also I'm going to change this part as well 1 4 because uh, we were displaying four variables hp and uh, hp number and the weapon and the weapon name but now we only use this weapon and the weapon name so i'm going to change this to one two and also we are not going to use this hp label and uh, hp label number anymore so i'm going to comment out this. You can delete this, but uh, I think I'm going to use this uh, HP label and number again. So for now, I, I just comment this out. So yeah, it looks like this. And uh, we are receiving error. I think this is uh, another pointer. Yeah, but uh, we don't have to worry about this because this is because we just uh, delete this HP label and HP uh, label number, so the program is saying, you know, uh, we cannot find this thing. So we are still using, you know, like this HP label thing. So uh, we're gonna fix it soon. So okay, let's make a, a progress bar. Okay. Uh, J progress bar. Okay, and around here. Uh, after this health bar panel, uh, health bar equal new J progress bar, and we enter some value here. And uh, this time I'm gonna type 15 because uh, in this game, player's max HP is 15, so I, I typed 15 here. 
and uh, we, we're gonna set the size of this bar the hard size dimension no new new dimension and uh, 230 so same as this uh, health bar panel number so width 200 and uh, height 30 and uh, import dimension and then add this health bar to health bar panel bar panel add health bar okay and we can change this from blue to black and let's check this so looks like this mm. but the color is white because uh, we haven't set any value in this uh, health bar so basically the value is zero right now so let's set some value and uh, since we have created this player setup method so let's do do it here so here uh, so first health bar this is j progress bar and the set value and the player hp so means 15 at the beginning of the game and also yeah this one hp label number we are not using this anymore so and this is causing this uh, null pointer exception error so let's comment this out or delete Hmm. Okay, so let's check this. Okay, so now it looks like this. Hmm. But uh, right now, you know, hmm. we also need to change like this one. So if you choose attack guard, then you receive uh, damage. And right now we are using this hp label number so let's comment out and instead of hp label number so we're gonna use this health bar health bar and the set value and the player hp so same thing and also yeah so if you go north then we can heal our hp so this one as well comment out this hp label and uh, health bar set value and the player HP and uh, also in this battle sequence so here we receive damage from monster and uh, we are still using this HP label here so comment out and health bar set value and the player HP and that's everything I think so yeah let's check the game okay so this time no null pointer error start so if you attack the guard, then yeah, your HP decreases. You receive three damage. Attack again and another damage. Yeah. Okay, let's leave and uh, let's go north. So you drink the water and uh, you can recover your HP like this. West and the fight goblin. And so yeah, if you want, you can make a. Uh, another health bar for this monster I think you know how to do this because basically you know you need to do the same thing if you're not so sure how to do it then uh, 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 please feel free to leave comments and then uh, I'm gonna explain and uh, okay so attack zero damage four damage yeah two damage yeah so it's working mm. And so right now your health bar has this 
light blue color and white color. This is the default color of this J progress bar, so you can uh, change the color of this bar if you want. For example, uh, here, J progress bar. Ah, maybe not here. Here, here's bar and uh, set background color. So in this case, background color means uh, how to explain. Uh, the value you lost. So, yeah, I'm gonna show you. Uh, red, I'm gonna choose red in this case and uh, set foreground. And this is, I'm gonna choose green. So, this is the value you currently have. And so, okay, let's check. So now your HP bar looks like this and if you receive damage then like this so probably this more this looks more like a HP mm. so attack and leave fight goblin one damage five damage two damage one damage two damage two damage two damage two damage Two damage, two damage, two damage, one damage, you are dead. So, yeah, so I think that's everything. So like this, you can display your HP bar instead of number. Mm. Anyway, uh, that's it for now. So uh, if you have any question, please feel free to leave a comment. And uh, thank you very much for watching and see you again. Bye.